Jenny, played by Faye Ripley, seemed in high spirits at the beginning of Cold Feet as she and the group of friends gathered at the wedding ceremony of Ramona Ramirez, J.C. Sowles, to welcome back the ITV series. Following the celebrations, Jenny and her husband Pete Gifford, John Thompson, returned home with the 50-year-old reeling off a number of systems she was feeling, believing she could be experiencing menopause. However, Pete had other ideas and thought the two could be expecting another baby with Jenny taking to the chemist to get a test to clarify if she were pregnant. Jenny was then seen at a GP practice where after an examination, the doctor told the mother she wasn't pregnant, but she had found discovered a lump on her breasts. No don't give Jenny cancer cold feet viewer viewers quickly took to social media to voice their upset at the tragic prognosis with one writing on Twitter, my heart just sank dot 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 and hash cold feet. Another added, oh no don't give Jenny cancer I have never got over Rachel dying hash cold feet, referring to the death of Helen Baxendale's character Rachel Bradley's series 5. A third commented, please don't let Jenny be ill hash cold feet, followed by a crying face emoji. Jenny does not deserve this hash cold feet, a fourth remarked. Continuing the flurry of upset, a fifth stated, I'm not ready for Jen to tell Karen about the breast cancer scare hash cold feet. After receiving the shock prognosis, Jenny returned home to Pete who had just saved a man's life by jumping in the river to stop him drowning. She told her husband they would not be having another child, but failed to explain the possible reason behind her symptoms, including the enlargement of her breasts. Jenny was told by the GP she would need to undergo further tests to clarify whether she would have to undergo treatment for breast cancer. Speaking of the storyline, Faye Ripley, 52, told press including express.co.uk, they actually talked to me this day last year and they said, how would you feel about that as a storyline? And I just said, I just want it dealt with properly because of the weight of that responsibility because so many people I know are affected by breast cancer and cancer in general. Sadly, that is life at the moment and I just wanted to do it right, that little bit I was doing. The storyline will be one that plays out throughout the six episode series with Andy Williams star James Nesbitt, 53, adding, in the sixth episode, she's incredible in it. James' character was facing a few struggles on his own tonight as he began to fall for a girl at a local coffee shop, believing she was flirting with him. The father of one offered to take the barrister on a date, but she declined stating she was already seeing someone else. However, it was revealed later in the episode her boyfriend was Andy's son Matthew Williams, Cell Spellman, but the two split when she arrived at the family home only for Matthew to discover his father had a crush on his girlfriend, Willis tear the father and son apart for good. Cold Feet continues Monday at 9pm on ITV.